Chapter 18 of On the Duties of the Clergy, Book the Second. This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information, or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. On the Duties of the Clergy by St. Ambrose, Book the Second, Chapter 18. We learn from the fact of the separation of the ten tribes from King Rehoboam what harm bad counsellors can do. Justice, then, especially graces men that are set over any office. On the other hand, injustice fails them and fights against them. Scripture itself gives us an example, where it says, that when the people of Israel, after the death of Solomon, had asked his son Rehoboam to free their neck from their cruel yoke, and to lighten the harshness of his father's rule, he, despising the counsel of the old men, gave the following answer at the suggestion of the young men. He would add a burden to the yoke of his father, and change their lighter toils for harder. Angered by this answer, the people said, We have no portion in David, nor inheritance in the son of Jesse. Return to your tents, O Israel, for we will not have this man for a prince or a leader over us. So, forsaken and deserted by the people, he could keep with him scarce two of the ten tribes for David's sake. End of chapter 18